With the launch of Entorque in the year 2018, we have seen multiple editions and updates on the Entorque. And today we have the Entorque XP125 with us, which is not just about the graphical changes and designs. It has got changes in the engine performance too. So get so before getting into the details of this scooter, take a moment to subscribe to Torque and Throttle and click on the bell icon for further notifications. So, what are the cosmetical changes brought to the new Entorque XP125? The color scheme, that is this red and black, is only for the Entorque XP125. And the only problem of this vehicle is, there is no other color option for the Race XP125. The Entorque XP125 gets addition of certain grey elements onto the body, in this part, and in the front, and in the rear too. And then, the new update is on the alloy wheels. You get a set of red color alloy wheels and even a red exhaust fan on the engine on the other side. The Entark XP125 has a sharp look and it is the overall look of the vehicle is completely aerodynamic. And then talking about the other design and features, we get a complete LED setup at the front with an LED DRL and you get an LED backlight too. Then you get the split rear seat holder for the pillion and then you have fake carbon finishes on the handle and at the rear too. And the one more aspect regarding the design and styling is this exhaust which is crafted according to the aerodynamics and sharp look of the all new Entorque XP125. Now talking about the speedometer, here you have the mode button which is used to switch between the street mode and the race mode. But then now you don't require that button while riding. Instead, you can click on to this voice listening mode in this self start button wherein if you are connected to your phone or a mic, you can just activate the race mode by just telling activate race mode and then torque recognizes it and switches to that mode automatically. The other details include engine heat, fuel gauge, then the clock and the lap timing. Now talking about the boot space of the Entorque XP125, you get a 22 litre boot space which is more than enough to accommodate a big helmet and other things and then you have a charging port here, with that you get a holder for your documents or the toolkit. Now it's time that we take the Entorque XP125 to the road and test out how this new 3 valve 125cc is going to perform. With BS6 norms implemented. The N-Torque, which had a very peppy ride when mounted with its BS4 engine, came down a bit in performance with the addition of fuel injection. Although there is a small marginal difference in the paper figure, it wasn't that responsive as before at high speeds. But now, with the launch of N-Torque XP, we get better performance as before, and it is a powerful 125cc scooter in India. With better gas flow and combustion rates and reduction in weight, TVS has managed to increase the power by 1 horsepower, that is 10.2 horsepower at the rate 7000 rpm and 0.3 Nm torque compared to before in the same 124.8 cc single cylinder air cooled engine. The two riding modes has significant changes when rode back to back. The street mode is a balance between fuel efficiency and power, while race mode uses all available power from the engine. Entorque XP gives a mileage of 50 km per litre in highways and around 44 to 45 km per litre in city. And these figures are in the street mode. And these figures can vary according to your way of throttling. Entorque achieves the highway speeds with ease and it is very comfortable to cruise around 80 to 90 kmph with the Entorque XP125. When it comes to handling, the Entorque seems to be very much planted and confident around the corners. And I have to specify that it is very assuring in the corners. The ride quality is great and you'll have a comfortable ride throughout. When it comes to the suspension, it is neither that stiff nor way too soft. It handles bad roads very decently compared to other scooters in the segment. And the bumps and small portholes are pretty much absorbed by the suspension in bad road conditions. But during higher speeds, small twacks can be heard when jumped upon portholes and bumps. Now, talking about the ergonomics of the Entorque XP125, 
you get a pretty upright position and then you have a decent amount of foot space not that great though but then if you are just concerned about riding this is well well done and well crafted and then what i have to specify is this mirrors it get, you get a good view of what is happening behind you while going on a ride and then the pillion gets extra comfort because of some adjustment in the cushioning they have done this time talking about the braking performance it is excellent as expected from tvs and this has the smallest braking distance in the segment with 60 to 0 kmp in 15.11 meter with an extra room price of 89211 this is almost 1.2 lakhs on road and who is this scooter meant for for a person who wants an enthusiastic ride and sporty performance from a scooter this is the one for you but if your concern is about mileage and leg space like a typical scooter then you will have to look for something else thank you all see you in my next video